Hello class, today we will be learning about proportional relationships. Today's weather forecast, thunderstorms likely, possible flash flooding. Hello there. Just fixing some loose shingles before the storm comes. It's my job to keep an eye on things around the lake. We're home to some quite exotic wildlife. We're currently tracking a major storm system that will impact the entire country at some point in the next 48 hours, forecasts predict record-breaking rainfall. With that amount of rainfall possible, I should calculate how much the lake could rise, and for that, I will use proportional relationships. A proportional relationship simply means that the ratio between two variables stays constant. For every hour it rains, the lake will rise two inches. That is a ratio of two to one. In a proportional relationship, that ratio remains constant. Now to find the unit rate, just simplify the ratio, which gives us a unit rate of two. So if it rains for two hours, the lake will rise four inches. If it rains for three hours, the lake will rise six inches. Proportional numbers always increase or decrease by the same ratio. Did you check the weather? The sky looks clear, should be nothing to worry about. Don't you have work to be doing? How much longer do you think it will take to get to the campsite? Let's see, we are keeping a rate of three miles every hour. We have been hiking for two hours now. So that means we've been six miles. If the entire trail is nine miles long, how much longer should it take? If we keep the ratio the same, it should take a total of three hours to hike nine miles. I'm glad we finally made it. This is a nice spot. What's the status of the lake? We need to talk about evacuating everyone downstream of the reservoir. It's already near capacity. We can't lower the water levels fast enough. Considering we're already receiving more rainfall than we can contain and the main part of the storm system hasn't even arrived yet, I just hope the dam holds. It sure is getting cloudy. I thought you said it wasn't supposed to rain. We should probably get inside. Here, I have charted some of the data for how much the lake will rise. Proportional relationships will always look like this on a graph, always a straight line, and always go through 0, .00. And here are the same numbers on a table. The storm is hitting us now. The water is spilling over the top of the dam. Too much more of this and it will wash out. I will let him know. Yes sir, the water is over the dam now. What should we do? Roger that, sir. I'll wait to hear from you. Get him, Lake Snake. Get him. Call someone. The water is coming up too fast. I've got an emergency beacon somewhere in here. We don't have much time. I think it's time to pull the plug, and I've sent someone to get that couple, the ones that couldn't be bothered to check the weather, before going camping. Well, I guess I'd better get to work before the dam breaks and the whole town floods. Talk to you later guys.
Thanks for stopping by. A quick review of today's lesson before you try your own practice problems. All proportional relationships will increase or decrease at the same rate on a table. When finding the unit rate, also called the constant of proportionality, find the ratio of 1. And finally, a proportional graph will always be a straight line and it will go through the origin or the point zero zero. Now it is your turn to practice some proportional relationship problems. The answers will be shown at the end of the video. What should we watch next guys?